Let me show you the Ekegusi derivation of the name Emmanuel. Okay, now, but we'll talk about the Hebrew version first. But I'll tell you guys, the name Emmanuel in my language is pronounced like we, like I say, we don't have any L, so it will be Emmanuel. That's how I've had them pronounce it. They say Emmanuel. So, but let's first start with Emmanuel here with the Ivory version. Now, we'll start with um. With the first syllable, im. Im means in the Hebrew language means with, and then uma means family, and el means God, meaning God who is with us, you know, as a family. That's what the name Emmanuel means. Now, Emmanuel in my language comes from the word, I believe. So now, Emmanuel in Ekewusi now would come in and we'll do the first, let's do the first syllable, Ime, which then would be Im or Ime, which then would be, in Ekewusi Hebrew, Ime means inside. Imenwe means inside you, plural. And then Eri means God. Now, as we had earlier discussed, so Ime Enu Eri means God who will live inside you. So, um, but we still have another, um, we still have another agglutination here. Now, look at the name Emanu. Emanu, Emmanuel, we're still talking about another meaning of Emmanuel in Ekewusi. The second meaning, Emanu is a lamb. And Eri is a bull or God, the preponderant one. Now, Emanueli, which makes Emanueli, as they call it, Lamb of God. So then that means the combination of Emmanuel in Ekewusi would mean then mighty Lamb of God who lives inside us. 